Welcome back to Ozarks Box AM Live from Top of the Rock, the Bass Pro Shops Legends of Golf Tournament. And Kelly, I have to tell you, one of the most beautiful places in the Ozarks yes. anywhere is Dogwood Canyon. Oh, yeah. It is so beautiful. In fact, I got to go there the other day and experience the trails, and I saw some wild animals also. Yeah, yeah. take a look at this. Okay. When I think of Dogwood Canyon, the first thing I really think of is just the natural beauty of the Ozarks. Yeah. The dogwoods, the redbuds, the trees, the streams, the fish. There are so many ways to experience the beautiful nature here at Dogwood Canyon. I'm here with Shelby Stevenson, who's the public relations manager here. And there are so many ways to explore nature here. Yes, there is something for everyone to do here at Dogwood Canyon. So we've got an amazing, you know, education center and grist mill that teaches people about the heritage and the history of the property. And then it's time to get out and explore. And there are so many different ways that people can choose to do that. Of course, one of the most popular is walking or biking the trails that we're on right now. It's a three and a half mile uh, one-way trail to the very back of the canyon, which is where we are right now. So if you make it all the way to the back, if you keep walking, keep biking, this is going to be your grand finale that you're going to come and get to see. Uh, and then the good news is, is the way back, it's a little bit downhill. So if you're on a bike, you're coasting the whole way back, you know, through, through these beautiful trails. But beyond biking and walking, we've also got um, a lot of really fun ways that people can engage with the canyon that are a little bit out of the box. So you can actually do Segway tours. Really? And get on a Segway and explore the canyon that way. So that's kind of fun because nature and technology are coming together in a really unique way. We've got an incredible stables facility where guests can do horseback riding. We've got one hour rides for people who are maybe new to horseback riding and then a longer two and a half hour ride for those who are more experienced. And those do some beautiful creek crossings and go through some ridges. It's just a, another beautiful part of the canyon to explore. And last but not least, you can also do a tram tour or a private Jeep tour. This is great, especially maybe if you've got you know, someone in your family with limited mobility that they aren't able to do the walking or the biking, but they still want to see everything the canyon has to offer too. Something that's great for all ages. If you've got little ones who can't make that walk, do a tram tour or do a private Jeep tour. That's going to take the same path on the way into the canyon, so you'll still pass all of those amazing waterfalls and creeks. And then you'll actually leave the canyon floor. You'll cross the Missouri-Arkansas state line, go up into our upper pastures where we've got herds of American bison, Rocky Mountain elk, longhorn cattle, and white-tailed deer that will come right up to the tram, and you'll get to interact with this wildlife that would have called the Ozarks home over 100 years ago. So it's almost like you're stepping back in time to the way the Ozarks was and really is being preserved here at Dogwood Canyon. That's right, and that's why Dogwood Canyon is under a not-for-profit foundation to ensure that this piece of land, with how ecologically significant and special it is, is protected for generations to come. Oh my gosh, I love it. And when you said the biking tour, is it? do you have to come with your own bike or can you rent a bike? You can rent a bike. You can either bring your own or you can rent a bike here from us. And of course, can't forget, you can trout fish here at Dogwood Canyon too. Oh, so you can actually do fishing here? You can do fishing and we've got, uh, you know, you can guide yourself or you can actually meet with one of our fishing guides and we'll show you the ropes of fly fishing. Oh wow. Now I noticed too on the tram tour, we passed by a beautiful chapel. Yes. It is beautiful. Now is that for public use? Can you rent that for weddings or yes. how does that work? Yeah, so Hope Wilderness Chapel is just a beautiful little gem uh, here at Dogwood Canyon. We host over 50 weddings a year, so it's definitely a popular wedding destination. But when it's not in use for weddings, it is open to the public so they can go in and experience the beauty and serenity of that chapel as well. There really is so much. Taking that tram tour is eye-opening to seeing the Ozarks, the beauty, yeah. uh, the streams, the different types of fish. It's overwhelming to think that everything is right here in our backyard. Right here. And I want people to take advantage of yes. what we have here in the Ozarks. Shelby, thank you so much. Yeah, Dogwood Canyon here. is amazing. I, all I want to do now is just go look at the fish and explore. I just want to go hiking now. Yes, well, let's go. Let's do it. Okay. All right. It was so beautiful, and I got to tell you, Shelby was the best tour guide I've ever had. Mm -hmm. So informative, knowledgeable. There was not a question I threw at her that she did not know. Mm -hmm. And I, you know, like we do, we usually pre-interview before we roll. Right. And I asked a lot of questions off camera. Yeah. She is so smart. It's so beautiful. And I know you've been there. Yes, I have been there. It's not too far from my house. And you know what you said. I really want people to take advantage of it too, because we have so much beauty and so much opportunity here in the Ozarks that we don't think about doing. And a thing that I 
connected there was we rode the segways. You oh, mentioned you did. that. Yes, the segways. Uh, they've got a guide or two or four, however many, and it's so fun to do that. Uh, they're not that expensive to rent. You can do it for your family, and it takes a little bit of getting used to, but it's it's a yeah. fun ride. It's I've a heard lot of that fun. actually. Yeah. That's Balance. It's, it's a balance thing, and if you don't want to do that, uh, you can always walk or ride the bikes. Like you know, you said. that's what, when we were doing that. We saw a, a lot of people walking yes. it, a lot of people biking it, uh -huh. and some of the parents had the bikes with the little buggy attached to the back, and oh. they were hauling their babies around. How smart of them! It was so fun to see the different types of activity you could do. If you don't feel like walking, yes, you can bike it, you can tram tour it, you can. And uh, some of the folks in our family, everybody wanted to do something different. Some wanted to ride the Segways, some wanted to walk, some wanted to bike, and it worked out really great. And those bison are beautiful. They I was a little are. bit nervous because yes. they were looking me in the eye. Yes. And I was like, oh, what are they going to do? It's a little intimidating. It is a little intimidating, but they're beautiful. And you know how I love every animal. And yeah. seeing them that close really put it in perspective. And I was like, Oh my gosh, I love it even more now. I love it. I know. It's a great place to go if you get a chance. Go out to Dogwood Canyon. You will love You'll it. You'll love it. That's right. Yes. All right, more phone on Ozarks Fox AM when we come back. We'll be yes. right here. Don't, Don't go anywhere. Change the channel. <laughs> no. Yes, uh, the bison and the longhorns oh. is breathtaking views. So pretty. Oh, I loved it so much. I want to go back.